Hey Divas, so in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys this unit that I am rocking right now so if you guys aren't interested then definitely keep on watching. So before we jump right into the video I did want to let you guys know that this video is being brought to you guys by ilikehair.com so thank you so much for bringing this video to my fabulous divas but without further ado let's jump right into the video. Okay Diva, so jumping right in, today we have a unit from I Like Hair. This is actually one of their eye part units and I'm so excited because with those units, you do not need to leave any hair out, okay? So here I'm just unboxing everything, you know, it comes with some good necessities that you will need as a wig wear, okay? So I'm just going to go ahead and unbox those really quickly for you guys, so... You guys see we got some goodies here now here's the actual wig the actual wig is so beautiful straight out the box I'm gonna be trying it on and everything for you guys um, I don't remember all the specific details just that this is a I part unit however I will have the links provided in the description box below so make sure you go ahead and check that out one of the main features that I love on this unit is the security it has a bunch of combs as you guys can see and it also comes with an elastic band that fits really well and it also comes with a comb in a bag and the adjustable straps which I love and look at how good this part looks there is no track showing and you literally do not need any leave out with this unit and it's just it's mind-blowing you guys will see but here I'm just trying it on just to show you guys like how it looks and everything um because obviously you know you can still see my weight cap and stuff but here I'm just trying on the unit you guys know I like to try on the unit show you guys like what it's you know what it's giving first before we go in and you know make it work for me but yeah divas um, I'm just trying it on here for you guys so I'm going to go in and make it work you guys will absolutely adore this wig because in the next clips you guys are going to see, you guys are going to see how I'm working with this unit and really, truly being able to wear it with no leave out. But yeah, I'll stop talking so you guys go watch that. Okay, Diva, so I am going to be testing out this hair since this is the first time that I've had this type of wig. And I just want to test out the hair. I like to try to wear it for a couple days if I can. And with this one, I am able to do that. Um, so I did go in and wash the hair and this is how the curls look. So they look very nice and natural still. I did just go in and wash it. Um, I did use this sulfate free shampoo by ORS and yeah this works amazing it has rice water and electrolytes and then I went ahead and conditioned it and I also use this ORS leave-in conditioner and this has a uh, rice water and electrolytes as well so it just really gave the hair just like a beautiful wash and finish and I just let it air dry for about like eight hours I left it um like throughout the day and everything but it looks really really beautiful so the whole idea of this wig is to wear it um either with minimal leave out or um no leave out at all so right now I wanted to test out the no leave out at all I went ahead and parted my hair in the middle and um, I'm going to try and wear it. Oh, my hair is like, I tried to lay it down like. But yeah, so I went ahead and I laid my hair down the best that I could. Um, don't mind the back. I really just focused like on the front part. Um, so I did go ahead and tease this a little bit already because I saw that um, that was something being done. So I'm going to go ahead and open up all the combs. Um, probably not this back one here because I probably won't use that one but I'm going to open the ones that are on the side and I'm also going to use the elastic band to apply the wig so I'm going to use that first to go ahead and get my wig situated onto my head and then I hope that I parted this part long enough I think I did though yeah it looks long enough yeah so I'm going to go ahead and situate the combs where I need them. And before I clip them in, I just want to make sure that everything is where it needs to be. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to take the combs and I'm placing them into my hair. So I'm just trying to make sure. I just don't like the way that it looks like gappage like I don't know so anyways that's why I'm testing this out because I wasn't sure like how it was going to look 
so maybe if I pull it closer okay yeah I think me pulling it closer looks a lot better okay so now I'm gonna go ahead and clip the combs in let me see that's the only thing I hate about these little combs it seems like it's so hard to like clip them in <laughs> so we're getting these combs clipped in so I don't know to me that doesn't look too natural so I'm gonna take some of the tools that they sent out and I'm going to try to make this look as natural as possible because right now this looks very clockable and that's why I was saying that I might do leave out because yeah even if it's just like a little bit I'm fine with that but anyways um, I'm going to go ahead and just use um, my little edge brush and I'm gonna kind of tease it to go towards this way and I'm gonna move the wig over gonna try to get the wig as close to my part first as possible because it's just I don't know like it just looks a mess to me right now now I'm just going to tease it and just kind of like brush it the opposite way how it's going this way I'm gonna brush it this way just to see if I could kind of get it to look like more seamless Oh yeah, that seems to be working. I'm trying to figure out like what can I do to make this more seamless. Take this piece of hair and kind of... That kind of made it better. Of course you want to bobby pin it in place, but I'm just doing this to try it out. So I just took a piece of hair and I kind of like put it towards like the part area to kind of close up the gap. So yeah, that looks a lot better. So I would give you that advice. Like yeah, that looks amazing. Okay, let me grab some bobby pins. So anywho, yeah, we're going to take these two bobby pins. So first, and I'm going to do it on both sides to show you. So you just want to take like a little tiny, like a little piece of hair. Like literally a little bitty piece of hair. So this is your piece of hair here. And I need to fix this. The combs are not. That's why I don't like these combs. Anyways, so I'm taking this piece of hair like from the back. And I'm going to bring that. And we're not going to pull it like super taut. But just like enough. And then we're going to take the bobby pin. Okay, we're going to take our bobby pin. And then put it here. And then you can situate it like don't put it too tight so that you can kind of move the hair around and then we could put like holding spray or something once we're done so that it you know the hair pretty much won't move and stuff but you see how it kind of gives it like that natural look so we're going to do the same thing to this side so we're just going to take a little piece of hair going to move this up a little bit i unclipped it and then now we're going to clip it again, take the little piece of hair and just wrap it, take a bobby pin, and then smooth it out as you see fit. Like I feel like that gives it a more seamless type of feel rather than what was going on before because I just feel like even though there was no tracks exposed it's still I don't know it still didn't look but I feel like this looks a lot better it looked like it's giving scalp now so I'm gonna kind of let it sit on my head and everything um I'm actually going to apply a little bit of my got to be just to make sure that this stays in place Okay, you guys, so I finished my makeup and everything, and I took my scarf off, and this looks freaking phenomenal, okay? Like, this looks like it's coming out of my scalp, and I am so here for it. Like, wow. Like, it looks really, really good, you guys. Like, I was really surprised, because I was like, I just know I'm gonna like it more, like, with the leave-out, but I'm loving it with this with no leave-out. Like, this looks good, you guys. So, I'm gonna test the hair and everything, and I'm gonna come back another day. I think I'm gonna test this hair out for two days, just to see, like, what I think about it. Um, because I feel like it's very telling in one day, but 
you know, I got some stuff to do, got some places to go. So I figured this hair is really cute. So I'm like, why not wear it? Um, yeah, because I love the texture of this hair. It's super soft. I did receive minimal shedding and tangling. And the hair and the curls are just really soft. They are really natural looking. Like, this looks like it can definitely be my hair. So it's good that it looks like it's coming from my scalp. But, yeah, like, this is the bomb, you guys. Like, I am so here for just with no leave out but next time i come back i'm gonna show you guys with leave out everything because i have some products that i want to test out too and i'm just curious to see like what this would look like like with some leave out because it looks bomb without leave out and that's the whole point of the wig but i just want to see for those who love to wear you know your leave out but anyways i'm gonna test this hair and i'll see you guys in a couple days okay diva so now that you guys have gotten all the details and the specs on this hair and i have tested this hair out i am ready to tell you guys how i feel about it so let's just jump right into this review so i know i said i was gonna come back and have like leave out so i will go ahead and insert the clip where i had leave out but honestly i didn't like it with leave out honestly i love it with no leave out it's perfect for that purpose but if you do want to leave leave out you can um i just feel like it's a more of a protective style for me personally because i'm trying to get my um hair back on track and back healthy and everything so this whole no leave out thing is a vibe for me like it's working and it looks so freaking good it looks like it's coming from my scalp and yet I am not damaging my hair I didn't have to do like a ton of strenuous work no lace no glue no nothing okay no sewing no anything and you do not see webs nothing is clockable it just looks really really good and I'm just so happy that I got to review this unit because I would have never known. Like, I didn't know that I even needed this wig. Like, this is just so freaking beautiful. I love the pattern as well. Like, this curl pattern is just so natural looking the curls are just so juicy and beautiful and all i did was go in with my leave-in conditioner and water and that's it for today and i let it air dry for some hours i kind of let it air dry all day um while i did some other things and yeah like it's just so freaking beautiful like i really really do love this unit i'm just blown away by the fact that none of my hair is out and it looks like i have leave out i would definitely say that you do need to buy this unit and i also have a coupon code honey i am going to save you those coins and save you all the work from having to do lace glue leave out and all of that okay honey so make sure you check out my coupon code and use this so you can save some coinage but yeah thank you so so much for watching i do appreciate it if you did enjoy this video and find it very helpful and easy to follow then please go ahead and give me a thumbs up be sure to leave me a comment down below i would love to hear from you and know what you are thinking let me know have you tried this wig out already or are you going to try it out or if you have any other questions or anything definitely definitely let me know and be sure to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already and also hit that notification bell i do upload quite often and you definitely do not want to miss any of my videos but yeah thank you so so much for watching it is greatly appreciated and i'll see you guys in the next video bye